Most major currency pairs have reached their respective oversold and overbought areas as indicated by the relative strength index where it measures the weakness and the strength of its prices in a given period of time frame. This has been the norm of the market prices thereafter an expected correction to the opposite direction shall be made. The RSI, commonly known for its relative strength index as a technical tool, is quite effective, especially where a combination of divergences and convergences are created by the prices from time to time. This is where we could identify two opposing directional lines between the RSI and the prices by using any of the chart types. What we have here is the Euro dollar on a daily basis and the indication here as encircled by the yellow circle is a spike formation where a possible retracement to the high side is in the making. And as indicated here, it is within the relative strength index oversold area where the prices would have the tendency and the probability of going higher is greater. And as you could see, as the momentum here have increased together with the prices, although when it reached this part on the chart level, the indication here on the relative strength index already showed an overbought area where the possibility for a double top formation is significantly identified where a drop of the prices more than 100 pips have been indicated here on a daily basis while it already became an open area for the relative strength index to get out of its overbought situation and the prices continued to move higher as indicated here much more than three to four hundred pips where the relative strength index have already adjusted and the prices is much more higher than the previous price level. This is what we meant about a sharp drop or a huge difference when the price is corrects from a possible double top and when the prices have made that adjustment together with the relative strength index the continuation of prices would still move higher much higher than most people would have expected. The same indication here where it's already on the low side price level of 1.32 and the relative strength index again was on the oversold area and made some corrections along the way although the trend is still relatively lower when the prices went much lower and broke the previous support of 1.32 and the prices made the low at the 1.2990 level and it's on a consolidation period as of, of this time. So prices are mostly changing and sudden change of directions may provide some significant signals although they may be false signals and a continuation of a drop was in the making at this time. In this chart you would be using the candlestick, the moving average, as well as a channel line on the resistance and supports the momentum 
the relative strength index where this technical tools is barely a combination of what you see on the cash market this can also be used as a signal indicator to determine a continuing action and corrective move is expected or not after a dramatic move in the prices however one must be keen in looking for discrepancies in percentage change when it does as changes in prices from each time frame or period covered can make a big difference a single price move or action alone can leave an overbought and oversold area open for a continuation of the price trend and not entirely a probable trend reversal or a simple price correction in the making as shown on the previous graph the appropriate supporting technical tool that could be used to identify such speculative action would be having a full working knowledge and understanding of the price action between the volumes open interest of the financial futures and spot FX market since prices are inversely correlated in both markets proper guidance as to how such relationship can best serve one's interest in improving their own respective trading skills vital for any trading success here are some details of how Megatrade 101 manages the available information from the spot forex and futures market combined in this chart type we have the western bar formation as compared with the candlestick bar charting system that we have previously shown and here what we have is the euro futures market where we have the moving average convergence divergence the relative strength index as well as the volume and open interest indicators together with the prices as compared to the previous chart that we have just to show you the comparison of the spike formation here and a trend reversal from that particular correction and moving forward here the indication shows that the convergence rather here have the crossover for the euro with high volumes which could have been that of a volume reversal however the indication here is shown relatively not as strong compared with the US dollar which we will also show you on the next few charts that we have so with higher volumes and a steadier open interest although steady to higher simply because the open interest and volumes are increasing and here we have a crossover of the MACD and relatively with the crossover here on the moving averages where a signal of a buy has been confirmed the inverse relationship between the euro as well as the US dollar index as shown and indicated in this chart is more detailed and like I said the inverse relationship is shown here where the spike formation although on a western bar charting system you would not be able to identify it unlike in the candlestick here as indicated with the reversal where a volume reversal has been made since the average volume here is on the lower part of the 40,000 
but looking at it more clearer that this has been a volume reversal where it is resting on a equidistant channel support and this is the resistance and the consolidation here from the previous support has shown the resiliency of the US dollar making a break higher which also confirms the volume reversal with enough volumes and a crossover of the moving average convergence divergence indicator and a continuation of the up move with a slight correction although as you could see here the volumes are increasing moving up as well as a positive tone for the indicators and has not reached its overbought situation at this time although the open interest here shows that open interest is down where we could see that towards the end of the month of December closing positions and liquidations are being made including that of position adjustments before the end of the trading year. So again what we have are uh, indicators moving hand in hand where we are using the analysis of MACD RSI which is the second volume and open interest which is the third plus the moving averages the sixth supports and resistance on a channel and a trend line seven a combination of western and candlestick formation eight and nine so we're basically using at least eight to nine technical tools in supporting both our trades on the euro as well as the US dollar index which we are using as the major indicator however a side-by-side -side look of the graph between the euro and the US dollar index would be more appropriate in the next following chart again without having to repeat ourselves the arrows and the circles here are indications of where the prices would have made their reversals especially on the downside where it is still currently now in the month of December towards the end of the year where the indications and reversals have been indicated because of the volume and relatively lowering of the RSI levels and of course without having to mention the fundamental reports between the US and the European debt crisis had been more of the reason why the euro has been moving lower at this time meanwhile the US dollar has been accelerating simply because of its flight to quality where investors would prefer to have their investments rather than the euro but the comparison of these two charts between the euro and the US dollar inversely related although by making use of the US dollar on the futures would be a significant support on the technical as well as the fundamental where the euro would be more likely to proceed with its direction lower at this time here is a before and after chart formation although what we have here is simply a weekly US dollar index where we have also used the 
Commitment of Traders Reports. As an indicator, together with the volumes and the open interest on a daily basis as a combination. By using all eight technical tools combined plus the fundamental reports significantly influencing the market, we have derived and arrived at a informative trading decision from the previous months and weeks that we've been trading that the established trend from there on had been a reversal for the US dollar index until today. Of course, without saying that uh, there will always be a ladder-like formation before it actually moves higher and the closing of the prices for the end of the year would probably be above the 80 basis points as we have mentioned in our market view report. This is a closer look of the weekly where the actual volume reversal have been indicated here with increasing volumes that making that the US dollar index is from the low of 7345 had been the higher bottom accelerating it on a weekly basis. Again this is a indicator where we have used the commitment of traders report from the CME on a weekly basis and we have indicated that the prices here have penetrated its major trend line significantly thus calling it a major reversal thereafter and the continuation towards the 80 level has been made. Please visit our website as we have a full detailed report in an article form of this market view that we are doing as a video. Thank you very much and have a pleasant day.